These people have been waiting for days to be allowed inside this temporary refugee camp in Adana in southern Turkey. They're Syrian and have been living in this country for seven years. But the earthquakes last month left them homeless. Samir Ilandekli says he and his family have nowhere to go. The second earthquake destroyed our house. We left the house with children without any of our belongings. So we've come to this camp where Syrians stay. I believe there's enough space in the camp, but we've been living on the streets for 14 days now. Turkish authorities did not reply to our questions on why these families were not allowed inside. Since the civil war started in Syria, Turkey adopted an open-door policy towards Syrians fleeing the conflict. There are now more than 4 million Syrians in the country. Many are living in camps where they have shelter, food, health care and an education. But over time, many Turks started to resent the support given to Syrian refugees by the Turkish state. There's widespread need for food, shelter and basic services all around the areas affected by the earthquake in Turkey. And that has increased the anti-refugee sentiment in the country. There are many who would like to see their refugees leave. Hundreds of people are living in this tent city in the center of Gaziantep. Meral Sakteroglu is one and she is angry. She says she is living in a tent with five other families, among them a premature baby. All Syrians have tents, but we Turks have nothing. We are living outside in terrible conditions while Syrians have tents. Aren't we human beings too? The Turkish Ministry of Defense says more than 40,000 Syrians have returned to their country in the past weeks. Many others here are also finding it difficult to survive in a disaster area and are considering other options. Ibrahim Ali is a Syrian journalist. He says he fears the lead-up to Turkey's presidential elections in May could increase hostile sentiment towards Syrians in the country. Some like, especially like from the right like side of like parties considering us like actually more loyal to other parties which is <laughs> make it like very difficult for us Syrians and if you are trying like to do like a little survey around between civilians they know nothing about policy uh, or like politic like here they're just like trying to leave millions of Syrians have come to Turkey to escape the war in their nation now they've lost everything they had once again and have to survive in a country that is not their own Teresa Bo, Al Jazeera, Gaziantep, Turkey.